JC Cornwell here at ImageWorks. Uh, Going to give you a little demo on using some of the features of the SP Reticle uh, plugin for Maya. So after you've loaded it and sourced the files and you want to get started making one, you can just launch that. And let's take a look at what we can do. Uh, this is what you get. It comes in as an outliner object. If you look, for example, in your film back attributes, you can change to the different uh, film back values. And say you want to display the film gate as well, you can check that on. And say you want to change the color of your film gate, you can do so. You can make it gray or you can choose colors as you wish, uh, whatever you want to do. Uh, you have a safe action area and you have a, a safe title area that you can turn on and off again with the same color settings there. I'm going to turn those off for the moment and set my color a little brighter. Uh, what else can we do? We have all sorts of different uh, options that you can uh, work with here. Let's look at text for example. Say you just want to add some um, a string of sorts. Um, I'm just going to put in some test text. And when you put that in, you can anchor that to many different parts of the scene. Say you want to anchor that to the film back. You can do that and you can also choose it to be bottom center. And you could have it, once you enter it, uh, show up here down on the film back or maybe you want it to display on the projection mask. You can do that as well. Uh, right now it's text aligned left. You can set that to center if you want it dead center. And that just gives you a chance to put any kind of string that you want in there. Let's look at uh, another type of text. If we want to put in a preset for a particular kind of variable, we could put in, say, your aspect ratio. And if you want that to display on the um, aspect ratio border, we will call that uh, top center. You can get that to display up here as well. And you can change the color as you need it if you want a little more faint or an exact color uh, you can do that as well and you can remove the text as well so you have a lot of options of what you can do with uh, SP Reticle and uh, so just give it a try go through the different options if you want to turn the whole thing off there's even a visibility option so you don't have to see it at all times so your choice so give it a try let us know what you think and uh, give us any feedback that you have alright thanks a lot